local reporting you can trust. You're watching KRQE News 13 at 530. Good evening. It's the city's latest effort to make public transit in the metro safer for riders. They've updated some rules, created new ones, and continue to ramp up security. News 13's Chandler Farnsworth is live at the Central Bus Stop with the story. Yeah, Madison officials say that through these efforts, they've seen a decrease of about 30% for bus-related incident calls. A lot of these seem, seem like basic, but we do deal with them on a regular basis. And the more that we can do as a community to take care of the facilities that we have, the better that that service is going to be. Transit officials hope some of these basic fixes will continue to bring incident calls down, like the new rules to ride they're implementing, such as no large carts on buses, no drug use, loud music or littering. They also have a de dedicated team with a mix of APD service aides, transit safety officers, and mobile patrol units. Longtime riders of the transit system say there's still work to be done, but are happy with the progress. Even though I've never experienced anything, right, I can't say that others have it. Um, because we know that there are issues in buses should, can and should be safer for everyone. Um, and I mean everyone, um, especially those who need it the most. Transit officials say APD service aides will ride the buses to de-escalate potential incidents, while transit safety officers will monitor bus stops. Officials are also in the middle of a safety study for the transit department. That study is expected to be complete by the end of this year. Back to you, Madison. All right, thanks, Chandler. We'll have more on this story tonight at 10.